All right, this is Crosswinds Campgrounds, Jordan Lake, Apex, North Carolina. This is site B49. This is our site. Pretty deep, but narrow site. There's our van, Maxine. We have a pretty big area back here. The picnic table and fire pit. So, not bad at all. We're gonna make the B loop. Is there are A, B, and C loops here. So right across. This is B50. We just came in for one night. To the loop. I'm not familiar with this loop. But I'm just gonna continue straight from B49 and B50. It's a beautiful fall day here in Apex. About 55 degrees, November 18th, 19th, something like that. This is site B51, which is lake facing. So these sites over here are lake facing. We're gonna go into one of them since it's empty. Surprisingly full campground here in the fall. This is B54. This is the one we'll go check out. Let's see the lake. Another long, narrow site. This one doesn't seem to be as level. Ours is really level, at least at the end. And then over there is the lake. I'm not going to go down. It actually looks pretty dry. I haven't had a lot of rain here lately. Okay, let's just continue on. This is being filmed on the DJI Osmo Pocket 3. And so this is B52, huge site. Oh, it's a double, double site, that's why. So that sign says duplex site, double fee charged. B52. This is B55. Again, another long, deep site. Over here is the bathhouse. A bathhouse, there are a couple in the loop. We've got toilets and showers in there, just like you'd expect in a bathhouse. This must be another duplex site, which is pretty nice. I don't think they have these at Poplar Point, duplex sites like this. So you can see pretty wide, pretty deep. And that is B56. Let's see, there's some big rigs here. And a Jeep or a Chevy. SUV, again, deep enough. And this is site B58. As the sun peeks through, B59 is another duplex site. And definitely room for two trailers and tents. And that one, B59, does have a lake view. Although, again, it's dry right now. Pretty big loop. This is B61. This one definitely not level. In fact, you may not be able to tell it, but it goes completely downhill. It's almost level at the bottom, so B61 is not, not the most level site. Here's Sorry for that, B62. Got an airstream in there. 
B63 is the site. B64, oh, truck camper. Don't see those very often. So again, this is B64. B65 here. Close to the road. Let's see the site number on this one, I'm not sure. We'll get it here, the car. So this is B66. Another duplex site. And then really big rig here. And B68. A big loop. I'm going to go left at the stop sign. This is kind of the main road where you come in. Another pretty good size rig there. This on the right is B12. This is B11. I feel like I should be yelling bingo at some point. Another good size rig there with the truck and two cars. And that's B13. And get an idea just how deep some of these sites are. This is B14. Oh, that's sun. Obviously, see the leaves littering the ground here. Another good size set up there. And that is B15. And then, well, on the sun side, this is B16. And I'm going to try not to film people, so I'm going to skip site coming up. But here it is. This is B18. And across is a really thin site, very narrow but straight. It's B17. And on my left is B19. I'm going to skip recording that because there are people. Don't like recording people without their permission. And this is B20. Pretty deep. Pretty deep site. This airstream here on B21. Deep site. And on the website, they have the specs of the sites, the length and width, and whether it's level or not. This is B22. Plenty of room for that setup. This is B23, a really deep site. B24. Probably a bad time to film this, a lot of people having breakfast. B26, like there might have been a tent there. And this is B25. I'm not going to film this next one because there are a bunch of people. But this is another duplex site here. Really deep. 
definitely room for two, two rigs up. And that's B27. Again, you can see the duplex, duplex site. B29 to the left, but I'm not going to film. Lots of people. Over here to the left is another bathhouse. So I'm going to go down this way, I think. No, I'll go down this way. This is a really big loop. About a 10 minute walk so far and I'm not done. These are all one ways, obviously, so you have to worry about two way traffic. You hear the birds chiming in. We'll get a view of the lake coming up over here. There's actually a beach here, and we're coming up to the beach. So, this is site B31, a duplex site again. Deep and wide. So this site is another duplex site. So that would be $60 instead of $30. Still pretty reasonable. And that is B33. <clears throat> so if you're looking for a water side view over here on the right, we'll cover those sites coming up. This is B35. Right there. And then this has a lake view. That's it. <coughs> Excuse me, the end of the lake and then site B39. Sorry, B36. This one kind of close to the road, B37. Not a huge site, but they managed to make it work. And then B B38 over here. And this is B39. I'm not going to film because there are people there, but they have a really nice, nice lake view here. So B39 definitely would be the prime site, and looks pretty deep. And then this is coming up to the beach, which is pretty nice. Papa Point doesn't have a beach like this. It's a bit windy. Hopefully that microphone is being shielded from the wind because it's quite windy. Yeah, you can see no alcoholic beverages. So if you wanted to go for a little walk on the beach, come down here. It's really windy on the water. There's some folks out here, so I'm not going to film too much, but get an idea of the size of the beach. Carry on. That is nice. Let's see trash bins here. I have them all over the place, so you can just take your trash and put it in the bin. And there's a nice little sidewalk, and there's plenty of parking over here at the beach. So if you didn't want to walk, you want to drive over. Certainly plenty of room, and there's the lake. So this site here has. Nice access to the lake. Looks like they've got a dish network set up <laughs> on the picnic table. And this is site B40. Pretty deep site again. And then this is the non lake side coming up on the left. Another duplex site. That 
is B41. Another duplex site, B43. Let's see how deep a mine that one is. And then another duplex site across the big, big site. And that site is B46. And you can see the sign there. This is B48. And this is our site. And there's one more part to this. So I'm going to pause here and we'll pick it up on the last loop. All right, a little out of breath, so this place is huge. Took a left for the other part, take a right at the stop sign here. And we should be able to finish up this tour. This is the, the main road. And that is B. B9, which is a duplex site. This is B7, and the crust. <laughs> the sun's in the way, but B8. Long narrow site there. B six. This, these might be a little noisy since they're on the road. Or GeoPro there. B five. This is B4. Across this B3, but I won't film it. There are people there. It's like a decent size, but narrow. Looks like this must be a duplex. This one is pretty big. I'm out of breath, and that is B1. And then out there is the, the main road. And that's it. So thanks for checking out this tour of Crosswinds Campground, Jordan Lake State Recreation Area, Apex, North Carolina. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like these types of camping videos, please subscribe. Until we see you again, I wish you health, wealth, and happy camping. Thanks for watching.